Welcome to myprojectbazaar.com. Now let's see the title of our project. Robust perceptual imaging based on ring partition number. This is the title of our project. Let's see the abstract. Nowadays there has been a huge number of images for that in existence. So there's a so there's a necessity for the image comparison for which question will be carried out with in our project we are gonna see about the image comparison by generating the image hash value which is carried out by ring partition and in MF image user need to provide some query image then it will be carried out by the normalization in which the query image will be converted into normalized uh, query image will be converted into normalized image by be, by means of creating the normalized image it will be carried out by further process acquiring the normalized image it will be carried by a determination of midpoint here the midpoint of the image will be calculated and the euclidean distance will be performed in order in order to determine the distance of the image determining the midpoint as well as the distance it will be carried by ring partition in ring partition the query image will be carried image will be converted ring partition will be carried out by encircling the query image the most circle will have in which the innermost circle will have the histogram values those histogram values will be converted into the matrix form which is called non negative matrix factorization generating a non negative matrix factor factorization for the inner circle then it will be carried out for both uh, for remaining encircling acquiring the non non negative matrix factorization for the inner circle then it will be carried out for the remaining circles then converting the histogram values into a non negative matrix session it will be proceed for rotation in rotation the pro, uh, that rotation the in rotation function the images from the ring partition method will be carried out for the which the user need to provide some rotating angle for which the that uh, for which that normalized image need to be rotated after performing the rotation the resultant image will be called as secondary image then user need to select uh, user need to provide some uh, after that user need to provide some another image for the compare second image will be then the then the second image will be then the second image will be carried out carried out by normalization as well as a ring partition and nmf after that after that it will not uh, it will not proceed for the rotation because the rotation is not applicable for the second image the resultant image from this process is called as processed image then after acquiring the secondary after acquiring the secondary image as well as the processed image it will be carried out for the image hashing process in image hashing process the image hash value in image hashing process image hash value will be generated for both the secondary image as well as the processed image after acquiring the image hash value it will be carried out by total correlation by which we can able to determine whether the whether whether the both images are visually similar or not now let's see the data flow diagram of our project here as i said user need to provide some input query it will be carried out for the normalization function in which the normal after acquiring the normalized image it will be carried out by ring partition and image will be called as secondary image so after acquiring the secondary image the user need to provide some uh, additional image for the comparison that is images that need to be compared so that image will be proceed with the, the normalization as well as the ring partition nmf but here the rotation is not applicable for the second image the resultant image will be called as processed image so after acquiring the secondary image as well as the processed image the it will be carried for hash generation so the hash value in which the hash value will be generated for both the secondary image as well as the processed image after acquiring the hash values of both images it will be carried out by a total correlation by which we can able to determine whether the uh, two images are visually same or not thank you now let's see the demo of our project the home screen of this is the home screen of our project here user need to provide some input query here we can able to see the properties of the query image let's proceed with this and that is some uh, normalized image for the input query which is which so the normalized image will be differed by the uh, dimensions as well as the quality factor let's proceed with this so after acquiring the normalized image the normalization will be performed so here we can able to uh, here we can able to find the properties of the query image as well as the normalized image let's proceed here for performing the ring partition we need to 
uh, we need to determine the midpoint of the query image as well as we need to calculate the distance of the query image the distance will be calculated by uh, euclidean distance uh, calculations we need to just uh, we, here we need to determine the total correlation coefficient for the both images here we need to determine the correlation coefficient for the both images then it will be carried by ring partition here the, here the ring partition will be carried by encircling the query image that is the normalized image let's proceed with after performing the ring partition here user need to provide some rotating angle for which the image for which the normalized image need to be rotated after performing the rotation operation the process the after performing the rotation operation the resultant image will be called as the secondary image let's proceed with the secondary image this will be the secondary image of our project here we can able to determine the properties of the secondary image user need to provide some image for the comparison let's select some another image here we can able to see the properties of that second image let's proceed with this then it will be calculated by the normalization we need to perform we need to calculate the midpoint we need to calculate the distance after that the ring partition will be applied for the second image let's proceed with this after acquiring the secondary image as well as the processed image the image hash value will be generated for the both images after generating the image hash value it uh, total correlation will be performed so that by which we can able to determine whether the both images are visually same or not let's proceed with this let's verify the image here it shows the here it shows that both images are different let's proceed with another example let's take some let's select some input image let's proceed with this we need to perform normalization it will be carried by the recessing of the query image let's proceed with this Querying the normalized image, it will be carried by the ring part. It will be carried for the ring partition methodology. It will, here, we, as I said, we need to determine the midpoint, distance, total correlation. Here, the ring partition will be applied for the normalized image. Then we need to. So by acquiring the image hash value, it will be carried for the uh, total correlation method. In which the total correlation will be generated for the both hash values, by which we can able to determine whether the both images are visually same or not. Thank you.